What can you expect from a restaurant who calls itself the Ministry of Fish Head Curry if not for its fiery signature dish? People, I'll, I'll introduce them uh, about our restaurants and the first thing they will ask us what is your, your, your restaurant's name? And I'll straightly uh, highlight to them that MOF and then they will ask us what is the MOF stands for? So I said it's Ministry of Fish Head Curry and the best part when I mention Ministry of Fish Head Curry most of the answers that I'm getting or the response that I'm getting from them is wow I believe you might be served the best ever fish head curry I say you are correct and you just come and enjoy I believe you're going to fall in love with the taste Coming up with the perfect fish head curry does not begin in the kitchen but at the market We are now uh, on the way to find our suppliers uh, which is the fish station and there we normally will pick and choose the best uh, quality of uh, fish head A few, uh, 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 I mean uh, fish head that been separated from the bodies but we not really go for it because we found like it is not really fresh uh, we always find the fresh ones In this wholesale market, it does not take long for them to find what they are looking for very firm. It's a lucky day for us. Yeah, it's a lucky day. We're gonna buy a lot today. Us. Yeah. <laughs> and we are getting a, a, a fresh pit at the first place. And so now we are just waiting for them to bring the knife to chop the heat from the bodies. And we are going to back to our restaurants, okay? And the next sessions will be on how we're going to cook the excellent taste of fish head curry all right okay in the fish head curry we use different spices some vegetables and uh, yeah of course we have some other things like a dry items we have different kind of spices in the fish head we have red chili cumin powder we have mixture of the five different spices and these are the spices we are using it we put some oil saute some onion garlic until you get some aroma and then we add some spices in it and we we saute a bit fry a little bit until we get the fragrance from the spices once we get the fragrance we add some cream the coconut cream some yogurt and then we cook it for a while and the fish head we actually steam it separate first we steam it a while and before we steam we put some seasoning in it uh, some salt paper some some uh, lemon juice to kill the fishy smell if you have any kind of a smell in the fish to kill the fishy smell then we steam it and in the water we put some lemongrass to get the flavor of the lemongrass in the fish head once we steam it half then half we steam and then after that we put in the curry which we already make it in the spices and onion garlic separate we cook we put the fish head in it and then steam with the curry another 5 to 10 minutes to get the curry flavor in the fish head and yeah, of course, after that it's done and it's ready to serve. With so much fuss put into this dish, the owners are confident they are going to do well. We are targeting to sell more than 150 to 200 fish uh, uh, in, in, uh, until end of this year.